Hello everyone, welcome back to Hotline Topics. Today, Tony Abraham has melted the heart of Nigerians home and abroad. Today being the first Sunday of the month and also the first day in May, the couple shared updates on their official social media platform where they shared a short clip of themselves. As a daily reported, many Nigerians have been celebrating what is alleged to be Tony Abraham's pregnancy boom. And many people are saying that they are expecting a baby girl and celebrating along with Tony and her family and also praying for her that when the time comes, she will have a safe delivery. But that is not all. The couple also shared a short clip of themselves with their daughter at a mutual where they were seen dancing joyfully at Redeemed Christian Church of God. Tony Abraham and her husband are Christians. And her husband, Kola Ole, usually gives updates on his official social media platform, especially on Sundays, and he shares pictures of himself and his family. But then, it's usually himself, their daughter, Temitokwe Witiwe. And many people often wonder if it is Tony that is behind the camera, because she's usually not included in the pictures. However, today was totally different, as Kola Ole did not only share pictures, he also went ahead to share this short clip. Of himself and his family in the church and many people are reacting to this short clip impressed with this family and doing his action today they are saying that the month of may is indeed going to be a good month these are some of the reactions ayabo Luklovis commented names go church today certainly may is going to be a wonderful month abby love 262 also added this one way our mommy read on the go church god's blessings and protection on your family always the social media user with a handle Ulu 8858 also commented, This month is super different. First time seeing you with your hobby at same church. Please keep it up. Love you doing that. Jesus Loba also had that. Hallelujah. Yari went to church. Uluwa Shion Fumi Ifederu also commented, Omi Ireti Losi Church. Uluwa Shion, God's love, mercy and grace will continue to uphold this great family in Jesus' name. Amen. Happy New Month, Happy First Sunday of the Month, and Happy Sunday. Blessed Daisy also commented, We don't go forward today as Mommy Rico Church. Omobolanli 4346 also commented, A family who loves God. A jockey church makeover. Mommy reigns to church today. A day ye more franca. My love for this family no be so. A day ye more franca. My love for this family no be so. Seeing this couple gives me joy. There are several other comments like this with people commenting that they are impressed when going to church today and they are also saying that this month of May is going to be indeed an awesome month. They are also wishing everyone a happy new month. For other recent news on this family, please stay with us. At the beginning of last month, Tony was in the news when fans noted that she looked pregnant and stressed and they were worrying over her health status. This was when she was spotted at the movie premiere of King of Thieves, famous Adibel Salami's movie. In a video shared by Goldmine TV, she was feeling uneasy, which stirred mixed reactions amongst fans. And so many people started saying, oh, she's pregnant, she looks stressed. Then that day, the outfit she was wearing was quite loose, so many people could not cite a baby bump. You are in another news, just about a week ago. Tony Abraham got all emotional as she celebrated one of her colleagues in the movie industry, Nedo. And she went out to describe her as a wonderful person and thank God for sparing her life. She even stated that she can't forget how Nedo stood up for her when someone didn't want to work with her, even when she didn't have to do it. This was all in her birthday message to Nedo. And in that day, the message she shared was Happy birthday, sis, Nedo. You're such a wonderful person. I thank God for sparing your life. I can't ever forget how you stood up for me. Maybe someone didn't want to work with me. Even when he didn't have to. But that story for another day. I just want to say thank you for doing that. I pray that when you need it the most, nations will rise to support you. May God bless you according to your heart desires. I love you. It must go on behind the scenes that we don't get to see or hear about. Also, some months ago, Tony Abraham has won critics who talked down on her husband. There were toxins on Connors that the actress was the one funding her husband's lifestyle and family, and some were also saying that she was older than him. In an Instagram post, she noted the fact that her husband is not as popular as she is, 
does not mean that he's not capable. Adding that whatever her husband has was from his hard work and not due to her popularity. In that day, she wrote, I don't usually do this and I'm only going to address this just once and I hope this ends here. People need to stop this mentality that famous people or the more famous ones are the richest in their family, relationships or even friendships. Just because some people don't like to blow their own noise doesn't mean they should be seen as less or incapable. I'm speaking of because I won't let people talk down on my husband who is a very hard working man and he's doing a lot for me and the kids. Do not ridicule his hard work and what he stands for. She also took to our official social media platform to heap praises on her husband saying that he has never been intimidated by anything about her. And she also appreciated him for his guidance that has never led her into any mistake. And she wrote, Kola Ole, you have never been intimidated by anything about me. You have always accepted me for who I am. You protect me, you love me, adore me, and you lead me right. There is nothing you've told me to do that has turned out to be a mistake. Okomi, you give me so much peace. You allow me to be me. You let me be my whole self. You enjoy my company when I'm being me. You never try to change me or clip my wings. You push me to be me before anything else. You love our children so deeply and I love you so much, Okomi. And today, while the couple was wishing everyone a happy new month, then you also went out to pray for her husband that as he is the head, will never be the tail. Meanwhile, many people didn't know about the story of Tony Abraham almost ending her acting career some years ago as she relocated to the United States. She shared this that a few years ago, during a very dark time in her life, she packed her bags and left for the US. She already made up her mind that she was done with fame and everything that comes with it. She was ready to quit and she said she was done with her career. Her motive for sharing that post was to celebrate one man called Wally Olaleye who helped her to embrace her career and to also go back in and to also go back to her first love acting during those turbulent times of her life. Revealing how she met the man, she said one day I got a call from a friend Doto who asked me if I was coming back to Nigeria. I told him I wasn't and that I was done. He then told me someone was going to call me. Shortly after, I received a call from Wally Olaleye. He asked me what happened and I explained everything to him. I told him I was tired. Mr. Ali said to him, you have a beautiful career. You can't just abandon your career. He told to tell me not to worry and that he was going to support me and stand by me. He insisted I return to Nigeria. When I returned, Wally got me a pair of tin, a lawyer, without collecting a dime from me. He footed all my bills. And because of this, I'm traveling my career and standing on my feet. Since then, he's never wavered in his support. So these are some of the other recent news on Tony Abraham. You have come to the end of this episode where Tony Abraham finally follows her husband and their kids to our CCG. After their viral video which has led many Nigerians to be celebrating them expecting a new bundle of joy. We are saying congratulations to the couple, may their joy be permanent and happy new month to everyone.